Welcome back to Primetime News. Special welcome to folks on OneSpotMedia.com. A massive fire damaged houses and livestock in Riverton St. Andrew today. Even as the firefighters manage to control the blaze, residents are complaining that the only fire hydrant in the community is not working. There are also renewed concerns about the frequency of fires near the Riverton Dump. TVJ's Kalisha Williams reports. Thick black smoke sending soot meters into the air. Nearby businesses feeling the effects while residents use whatever they could to block out the fumes. Firefighters on the scene quickly fought the blaze, but these shocks could not be spared. What happened was the cardboard, some cardboard over there, catch a fire, and I call him and tell him that the cardboard was on fire, and it spreads all over the place. I was trying to get it in control up over the fence, and it got out of control. Houses were damaged, and one man lost a few animals including some of the 20 pigs he said were bought last week. The mother them smart enough to take out some, but I don't know how much them take out. It's only who follow the mother them have a thing where and tell them feel danger, them go hide under the nearest thing. You know. The nearest thing, probably the plastic, them where I catch a fire, and the things them where I catch a fire, them go hide under. But I know me hear them a ball in there. He points to this fire hydrant, the only one in the community. It's not working. Hydrant. See the hydrant there? See, they're right there, so, but they turn it on right now, it'll it, it run lower down in my yard. Firefighters were also hampered. This fire truck had to leave the scene to source water elsewhere when the tank went low. This is where the fire started. As you can see, it's a pig pen. Some of the animals have been removed. Behind me, firefighters still trying to put out the blaze. The team from the York Park Fire Station declined to give a comment on camera. But we were told the fire started sometime after 1 o'clock Wednesday afternoon. There have been several fires in the area since the start of the year. A resident, identifying herself as Gillian, says she has had enough. She's even more worried about how the fires are affecting children. The smoke is not good for the kids. And most of the kids here have asthma. In the meantime, Executive Director of the National Solid Waste Management Authority, NSWMA, Audley Gordon made this appeal. We understand the anxiety. We don't want to have smoke uh, uh, polluting the air for the residents in and around the Riverton community also. I know NEPA has been making um, radio advertisements as it relates to the dangers of burning and what it can do to the health of the people. So we just urge everyone to desist from you know, lighting stuff. Kalisha Williams, TVJ News.